Hey there guys, Isrand here, and welcome back to Minecraft, A Pile of Bodies. In the last episode, we went ahead and we conquered both, uh, Caveman Films, for this awesome club, and Ant Venom, and this guy is gonna die. Is there a body down there? Oh, there is. Oh, wow. Hmm. So there were a couple of options, I guess, for where our flint and steel may be hiding. Hmm. Now, I'm not sure who this fellow is, but we're going to find out what's going on in his head. Because uh, this little contraption, whatever it is, looks kind of weird. Hey, it's a clock. It looks like another portal. It smells like another portal. But I can't... Can I use it? Oh, man, I'm gonna break it, aren't I? Yeah. Great! It's okay. If we find a flint and steel, taking your clock, then we'll be okay. Because there's gotta be one somewhere, right? There's no way for me to access that. Do do do. Thus far, being cautious has had no negative effects, so I'm going to continue to be cautious. Oh, that is a head. Who are you? God, I hear a lot of monsters. Ooh. Oh, I have been in you. You're the target guy. All right. What in the... Get... Sounds like they're above me. No. Bad monster. I am in the belly of the beast down here, huh? You're next. Bye. No. Okay. Is there anything in you? Nope. Who invited you? You are not invited to my birthday party, sir. Maybe the gentleman over there with the nether chin. You know what? I'm okay with that. You wanna go? <laughs> oh, wow. Creepers have incredible luck. Who knew? But his luck ran out. What secrets do you hold, Netherchin? Flint and steel? Flint and steel? No. No flint and steel. <gasps> Maybe it's Hero Brian. Could Hero Brian be holding the secret to our destiny? Probably not. But I'm willing to find out. Because it's bloody hero, Brian. I wouldn't put anything past him. A lot of emeralds. But I don't see an item frame, so no. Looks like he's half creeper. Creeper, Brian. Weird. That guy's head is like a nether fortress. I'm not delusional because I'm tired. You can't prove it. You have land down there? Yes, you do. I don't see! Oh, you want some too? Bring it on, creeper. You can go right off the edge. Now, where was the gentleman with the nether fortress head? What is this? 
Have I been... Yeah, that's that's Creeper Brian. Um, you. How do I go into you? I can just hear a thousand clicks for various that's what she said jokes being typed right now. Why am I inept at going in a one by one? Jeez. Don't answer that. Okay, so... Hmm. Holy cow. Cake! Lots of cake. Not much help, but it's kind of cool to see. I like cake. Ooh, but I also like melons. Who are you? Lots of redstone and a diamond pick. Well, Melon Master, we will meet again, I assure you of that, sir. I may not know a lot about redstone, but I know the basics, and those basics might help. What are you? What? <laughs> oh my gosh, that that was a dirty trick. That that was that was a bad trick. Like that was was just nothing. His head is nothing. It leads into the void below. Oh, that was mean. That could have been really bad. And another of the same. Seth Bling, bro, what are you doing? Uh oh. Well, I'm gonna die. <laughs> okay, manifest destiny. Goodbye, cruel bodies! <laughs> oh god, I'm tired. Well, that was fun. And now that we've successfully lost the caveman bone, I'm just gonna have to go back to the regular diamond sword. I blame my own sleepiness. Why didn't you have the flint and steel? Alright, guys. In the next one, I'm going to attempt to recover from a colossal failure. Huzzah! <laughs> uh, good night.